Welcome back to Born for Walrus. I'm your host, Stephen Weathers, and this is Abeline Rush? Abeline Rush? Abeline Rush? Let's call it Abeline Rush. Why not? Um, so the creator of this game contacted the Mournful Walrus business email, uh, requesting that I perhaps do a little video on the thing, on the game, because he currently has a Kickstarter going on, he's got 23 days to go as of right this moment, so probably 22 when this gets posted tomorrow, or something, and I thought I'd say, hey, why not, why not do it, I'm not doing anything, so let's see what the game looks like, and then I'll also put out a, uh, a companion piece, which is a look over of the Kickstarter itself, like I used to do back in the day. So let's see how this works. Ah, oh, sound dimmed. Okay. Um. Oh, I can use the controller. I guess I'll find my controller. I found my controller. Um. Um. Oh. Alright, I got my controller going, all good to go. Uh, I think everything else is fine. I have no idea what any of this stuff means, so let's give it a shot. I like the theme song. <laughs> Alright, okay. Sure. Alright, so this is like super alpha, basically. Ooh, fireball. So I've got spinny, sorty, jumpy thing. Punch? No, sort, dashy slice. Fireball and regular slicey slice. And pretty. Oh, okay, that's. <laughs> Not going to grass. Let's go down here, it's the Um, So, from my understanding, this is. pretty early in the game. I really like the way it looks. It. I think it's all hand drawn. Like, all the uh, animations are, like, everything looks hand-drawn, which I think is really cool. Um, so I think the goal was, like, 3000 bucks or something. I'm not... I, I don't know what that said. Damn it. <laughs> okay, I guess I don't get to see what that means. Oh, it's a thing you look at. Okay. Um... So I said, oh yeah, so I, this is still like super alpha, apparently. I walked into that cactus. Uh, it's super alpha. It looks, I really like the way it looks actually. It reminds me of like a um, Don Headfield. I think that's the name. Uh, Headfield. I'll, I'll leave a link. I'll put up an annotation on here somewhere. Um, he is one of the last. Why does that look different? That piece of grass is different. It's got to be a secret. Oh, wait. No, okay. Um, he was an animator for, um... I... He was an animator. He still is. He's still alive and animating. I can't remember what he was an animator for, if he was for anything in particular. But he's the guy who did... Okay, this is going old net for you. If you remember the rejected commercials, cartoons, like My Spoon is Too Big or My Anus Won't Stop Bleeding. Uh, these are all actual titles of of the car, of the commercials. Um, that guy, the guy who did that, um, he's put out four or five movies, like Angels and Idiots and Cheatin' and uh, a couple other ones I can't remember. He had a Kickstarter recently to get a full feature movie kickstarted. And, um, he, all this stuff is hand-drawn, and usually, as far as I understand, mostly just by himself. Like, um, you should really check out some of his stuff, like, if nothing else, to reject it to cartoon commercials, because they're just hilarious and very classic internet. Um, like, anyone who's been on the net since pre-2000s, or even, like, pre-2010, has probably seen it at some point, yeah, or at least seen something of it. There's a lot of GIFs of it just floating around Tumblr because it's just a classic and all that stuff. Um, you should definitely check that out. But yeah, no, this, like the, uh, like the art style of this game kind of reminds me of that, except a lot more. <sighs> so, the guy I can't remember the exact name of who I was just talking about, his style is so incredibly loose and fluid and almost like psychedelic at times, like... 
it's just a, it's mostly a mind trip of wonderful beauty and it's just phenomenal it's it's great stuff um i think his name's don hefield hefield i can't remember his name i'm not good with names in the first place i also can't remember the guy who uh who sent me this so thanks guy <laughs> Um, I'll, I'll, I'll cover that on the Kickstarter video itself, which I'm going to record right after this. Um, the game itself is got pretty, got pretty solid controls. Um, oh. oh, okay, cool. Uh, I'm a little haphazard with button pushing when it comes to menus, apparently. Um, I really like the animation style. Uh, the little square shadow is just a sign of this not being done yet. Like... According to the Kickstarter, the game is mostly done, like design-wise, but it just needs it needs some pretty paint thrown on top and to finish it up, basically, which is what the Kickstarter would be doing. That, like, you know, uh, releasing stuff. I think it's mostly for Steam, but there may be different goals, I'm not quite sure. Oh, the shooting sunflower seeds, I really like that. This is definitely Dawn. Dawn? I feel like it's Dawn. Dawn, Heffield, Heffield, I, I don't know. But, like, that's... I really like... <laughs> Good job, Otto? Is Otto the name? I feel like the, the email was from an Otto. I don't know. Um, but I really... I re I'm really digging the art styles. So good on that. Um, the controls are solid. It's, as advertised, it's very much like... Um, oh, God. Uh, Link to the Past, Legend of Zelda... Um, RPG over the top. I've got feeling to it, and I mean, you know, that's easy enough. If you're really into that, this is definitely your kind of thing. If you're kind of into it, eh, it's kind of your thing. Gunpowder or something, yay. Oh wait, yeah, gunpowder. Huh. I read the, uh, the, uh, description of what the demo covers, and it's like, you're finding supplies to make some kind of explosive a explosive tool for a later moment. So, you know, I'm building a bomb. <laughs> um, and murdering some slimy things. Which is cool. Um, I am really enjoying this, actually. I'm, I, I love the soundtrack and the art style. The controls are pretty solid. The character designs are... I mean, you know, all three of them. They're, they're pretty cool. I like the sunflowers a lot. And I really like the look of the slimy slime slimes. Uh, I can't really make out much of the main character, person, him or herself. Uh, you know, armor, pants, shirt. Yep, that's that's a person. Um, yeah. Okay, so I made it. <sighs> Crap. <laughs> Where am I gonna find a key? These are the questions. Huh? Are you a key? No, you're not. Are you a key? No, you're not. Are you a key? No. Um. Yeah. So, like, the description of the game is like, it's a lot like uh, Legend of Zelda. Uh, I just can't think tonight. Um, Link to the Past, like I said earlier, except focusing more on actually murdering things, like giant sunflowers and bombing on you, instead of like pushing blocks and stuff. Which you know, either way. If you ever had an issue with block pushing and, uh, and Link to the Past, well, hey, do I have a game for you? Um, did I come from up or did I come from down? I don't know. I feel like I'm going down. I don't remember this many spiky thingies. And there's a checkpoint. Oop. Alright, what are you? Are you nothing? You are nothing. It's empty. You guys would tell me if I already picked up a key, right? <laughs> eh, 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 eh. I do like how much health is laying around because I am crap at this. Kind of reminds me of like the Violent Femmes if they had more electric things and also no singing. I don't know it's 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 very college rock. I like it. Yeah, that's not super helpful right now. Whatever. And I'm using up all of my magic. Oh my god, my magic. Okay, where is the frickin' key? Dude, I see. Where the 
else the key? How, what is, do I, am I missing, what am I missing? Am I missing something? I feel like I'm missing something. Ah, that's, a, that's an opening. Anything down door number two? It's a slime. I can kill a slime. <laughs> Damn it. Where's the freaking key? Okay, so there's really not much more to the demo uh, than this, as far as now. I'm supposed to find the key, and I, there's a guy in the room who's like, I'll make you a bomb if you get me these pieces. And I get him the pieces, which I'm pretty sure... Uh, inventory. I already have... Slime butts. <laughs> uh, plant shots, black powder, sticker spikes. Token item. Don't know what token item means, but whatever. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm enjoying this. <laughs> I, 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 I'm enjoying this. It's a little rough around the edges, but it's, no, it's a demo. Whatever. You're gonna complain about a demo being kind of rough around the edges? Seriously? Oh my god, you're such a dick. Why would you even do that? Damn it. <laughs> Every time I see one of those, I'm like, oh, 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 oh. oh. Oh, I died, apparently. Uh, yes, please. Slime butts, I like it. That's hilarious. Oh my god, that's so funny. Um, I think it would be good if there was, like, a different animation. Not an animation, but, like, a different image. If you had already looked in whatever those are. Because I keep doubling back, I think. This feels like something different. So I'm like, I think I'm picking, what, I think I'm picking up coins. Is that what I'm doing? Anything over here? Wait a second. This looks awfully familiar. Oh god, I think I am doubling back. Uh, crap. Uh, I'm so lost. This is. Oh, oh, hello, Mr. Satan. Oh, who do we have here? Come for all my great values, or just some sage advice? Get into the castle. I can certainly help you there, but I'll need you to find a few things. So what's the other door? Five sunflower petals, a black powder, find them the cane sea bombs, seeded bombs. Most are empty, but a few still have leftovers, so I need... Some. Okay. Five. I need five of those. And something to mix them all together. Maybe a bottle left behind locked medic's post. So I still need the key, though. Find a key and maybe you'll get lucky. Yeah, that, yeah, okay. Sure. Yeah, that sounds easy. Like, uh, you know, I'll just find a key somewhere, right? If I knew where the fucking key was, I wouldn't be lost, now would I? No, I would not be lost. I would know exactly where I was, because I found a key. I really do like the soundtrack, though. That's, that's definitely something I am digging. I am most certainly enjoying the soundtrack. What I'm not enjoying is looking for this goddamn key. I like that I'm finding silver now. That's pretty cool. I don't know what the money's for, but I like it. I lock it. I lock it a lot. God, I haven't watched that movie in a long time. I should. I don't know. Should I? Should I watch Dumb and Dumber again sometime soon? Leave a note in the comments. Uh, speaking of Dumb and Dumber, have you met me? <laughs> <laughs> I feel as if I'm a little bit lost, and yet, perhaps not. I have found my way once again. <laughs> I'll take a penis, my dear, Trebek. Shock it, Trebek. You guys ever see that, um... It's like old school SNL skit with Alex Trebek and Sean Connery. That's a dead end, isn't it? Yeah. 
And it's just Sean Connery. I don't know. I guess he just hates Alex Trebek. Just hates him. So he's he's just constantly just messing with him. Like just most of uh most of his answers, you know how Jeopardy is, you know, you write the answer on the thingy and it's like, what is an apple strudel? Or something. Uh, I'm so lost. <laughs> a map would be nice. I mean, I'm not one for uh, demands, but I am so lost. Just like a fill in as you go kind of thing. That'd be nice. Also, I just found the enemy health from the bottom part of the screen. So, you know, that's funny. This is a really good loop. Like I haven't really noticed it end, so that's that's that's, that's good on you, man. Good on you, or whoever did this. You know. Whoever your sound designer is, well, I give him a high five. I sure hope this is all recording correctly. <laughs> I think the last time I tried recording something with OBS, things went wonky, and I. I don't think I had my audio set up right or something, and I just... Nothing. I need more health, por favor. Oh, favor. I pick up my money. I gotta pick up my money. I gotta pick up my monkey. Oh, God. Stop. <laughs> Stop hitting me out of the screen. I feel like it's Don Heffield. That sounds rightish. I don't know. I'd have to ask Marty Do. She is more familiar with the man's name than I am. I will openly admit that she has me best there. I feel like I just kind of screwed up in like the start of this and went the wrong direction from the start. I mean, I've done that several times in several games, so I would not doubt that. With... Oh! Hey, I found the hedge key, so I can unlock all of those bushes. <laughs> That's a dumb joke. I apologize. Anyhow, we'll be back in a second. Okay, that looks better. I think I made it back to the right building. Hey. Okay. Hey. I'll be back. <laughs> okay, this looks right. Hello, Mr. Satan. You found the bottle. Good. Now just find me the ingredients you need. Prune flowers. Sunflowers drop their sunflower petals sometimes. Wait, sunflower petals? I don't think I got any petals. God damn it. Alright. What do I have? Slime butts. Plant shots. Black powder. Hedge key. Sticky spikes. Uh, crap. Oh, God, what? <laughs> so I might have accidentally closed it out because I died while spamming buttons. So that's the demo. I actually really like that. That was a lot of fun. I really like the soundtrack and the art style. I have no idea what the story is. Uh, you're a dude. You can use a sword and shoot fireballs sometimes. And so what I was doing was getting supplies to build a bomb to break open the wall and get into the city i'm not 100 percent sure but whatever the case that was a lot of fun i enjoyed that um check out the um boop. check out ah, i'm so big i'm a big head uh check out the kickstarter video here in the corner Blink, blink, blink. Uh, which should be up around the same time as this video, so link back, link forth, whatever. Uh, check out the Kickstarter itself, because it's only, I think, 15 bucks for the game, 5 bucks for the soundtrack, which at first I was like, eh, whatever. That's a good, I like the soundtrack so far. I dig the soundtrack. Um, I will probably put some money down on this if I have money uh, before it's over, which, fingers crossed and all that. Um, I've been your host, Stephen Weathers. This has been Abilene Rush? Abeline Rush? Abilene Rush? I don't know. It was the game that I just played. Um, If you liked the video, leave a like. If you didn't like the video, leave a dislike. But preferably, leave a comment as well so I know why you didn't like it. Otherwise, I, I'm just going to keep doing what I've been doing because, hey, I don't know what I did wrong. What did I do wrong? I don't know. Um, 
mothers with a walrus like comment subscribe subscribe why not right you might get more videos that you like or not i don't know um